Hey, hey, everybody. Thanks for joining me on another episode of Cutting Up With Bay. Today, we're going to make another air fryer recipe. Yes, you heard me correct. We're making donuts. So we have some biscuits, and those were some cookie cutters that I showed you. This is the smallest cookie cutter in my collection. So I'm going to use that to cut the holes in the middle. You can also make this recipe if you don't have an air fryer, but I tried this and it tastes good as hell. And trust me, I was apprehensive about it tasting like biscuits. No, 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 you cannot tell at all. So now we're gonna load our air fryer. And if you don't have an air fryer, you would just get a skillet, some hot oil, and you would cook these on both sides until they're brown. But since we're doing an air fryer recipe, we're going to set our air fryer for 350 degrees. And I'm going to set the time for about five minutes. So I let these cook for about three minutes and now I'm going to flip them on the other side. And once I flip these on the other side, I'm going to put them back in and I'm going to make my glaze. Now, some people use butter and some sugar and some cinnamon and they roll the donuts around in it and that's good, but I like glazed donuts, so we're going to make a quick glaze here. So I have some confectioner sugar or powdered sugar and I added some milk. I like to add a little bit at a time, so I'm going to add a little more powdered sugar. Now, I like breaking the rules a little bit, so instead of vanilla extract, you can use strawberry extract, you can even use cake batter extract, but for today, we're going to use vanilla extract. And here, you want to mix everything thoroughly until it's nice and it's smooth, just like this. And if you like thicker icing, you can definitely add more powdered sugar. These are golden brown and perfect, so it's time for some glaze and some decorations. So you're going to take one of your donuts, you're going to dip it in the glaze. Now you can just dip the top if you want to, but my husband has a sweet tooth, so I'm going to dip both sides. You don't have to add decorations like sprinkles, but I think it's fun. This is definitely something you can do with the kids just on a late night. You can do it if you got the munchies. Like, this is an all-purpose recipe. So now that I've dunked all of my donuts, <laughs> no pun intended, I'm going to sit them on my rack. And I have two different types of decorations here. So I have these type of sprinkles, and then I also have these red, white, and blue sprinkles. So I'm just going to divide the donuts up. I think I'll do two donuts with the sanding sugar, and then I'll do two donuts with the red, white, and blue sprinkles, and I'll do one donut with just regular glaze. See, that sounds like a real order. <laughs> so we're gonna add these sprinkles and those are your air fryer donuts. I have more recipes that I'd love to share with you guys. I might post another one later, but hit that like button and let me know if you like this recipe and you want more or if you want me to change them up. So thank you guys so much for watching. Add me on Instagram at chefbay underscore. If you're on TikTok, add me at cutting up with bay. And until next time, peace out you guys.